These are my new Anchor USB-C to USB-C cables. I got these to use with a charging station that required a higher wattage. So these are actually rated to 60 watts. And I had some cables in the past that were supposed to be rated to a higher wattage. They were 30 watt cables. And when I actually put them to the test, they were only charging at about four watts. They were junky cables. So uh, I wanted to go ahead and test these and see if they can back up their claims of higher wattage. They are rated to 60 watts. So we're going to put that to the test and see, see what we get. They've got a cool little uh, strap on them for cable management, to keep things nice and tidy, which is pretty nifty. They're good, high quality braided cables with nice rubberized ends. So that's going to help them with longevity. So I'm really pleased with the design of these cables. Now we just need to figure out how they're going to work function wise. All right, so what I'm doing is I'm plugging into this MacBook Pro. This is a 13 inch MacBook Pro and it has a 70 watt power supply here. I'm gonna plug into the 70 watt power supply through this little meter that will measure the voltage, the amperage, as well as the wattage. And okay, yeah, uh, right now I'm seeing that I've got about 20 volts uh, and I'm getting about 22 watts right now. That power book is actually pretty well charged, so it's not going to pull a lot of current, but I'm already seeing way better results than I did with my other cables where I was only getting four watts of power. This is bouncing around between nine and 12 right now. Uh, let me run this power book down a little bit so that it will pull a little bit more current and we'll see what we get. Okay, so I really blew this. I should have waited until the computer was a lot more thirsty to try this out, but uh, I've worked really hard. It's got a, a fairly new battery in the computer, so it's pretty healthy. And so it's been hard for me to run the battery down. It's currently at 96%, which is not ideal uh, for, uh, for it needing to pull some power here. But let's take a look and see what we get anyway. All right, right now we're pulling 22 watts, 32 watts, 42 watts. Okay, 42 watts. I'm going to, 51 watts. Excellent, 52 watts. Okay, good. 59 watts. Okay, I'm going to say that 59.98 watts. The cable's rated for 60 watts, so I'm going to say that it's uh it's 100 percent legit 60 that hit 60 it actually kept a little above 60 so i'm really pleased this cable is doing what it says it's going to do and i'm really pleased with this with my battery utility i can see that yeah that it's pulling a good amount of wattage there and uh and the cable is doing exactly what it said it was going to do. So I hope that helps you with them because these cables do what they say they're going to do. They're rated at 60 watts. They will pull 60 watts. That's actually above what I'm going to need them to do, but it's nice to know that they are a good high quality cable and will do what they say they're going to do. So I hope this helps.